Hey yo together and very welcome to the start of two crazy replays today on Frost Leather Edition with a TVC. And as you can see I have to use the old overlay. Um those sounds are way too loud. What's happening? Okay, that that's better, I think. Okay. Yeah, uh, old replay uh, uh, overlay because of Blizzard still not managing to make it possible to use old replays and watch them properly. But hey, that's how it is. And here we have the Red Zerg in the bottom right hand corner of Frost Ladder Edition playing for himself. It is Ominous. Some kind of Master Zerg, and he's playing against me, the Blue Terran, in the bottom left hand side, playing for Pro Kings, it's Alex Sasha. And I haven't been able to play too much StarCraft 2 lately because of university, and this will continue for quite some time now, but at least the good thing is, I will stick Master League Tier 1, uh, even without practicing too much, to be honest. Uh, I just reached that uh, skill level. And I will hold it, even if I just play two games a week. It's it's. I won't be top notch tier one. No, I will be bottom tier one, but still tier one master league. And I'm somewhat proud of myself to be able to hold that skill level without practicing too much. Uh, I can imagine that in GM it's way more difficult, but yeah, that's for me. It's fine. And so far it looks like we see the typical Reaper expand. And I'm not quite sure if Ominous was going for hatch gas pool, uh, but I think this is too early, so it has to be pool or gas pool hatch. Mm, yes, yes, it, it should be gas pool hatch in this in this game. And there we see the second barracks, quite on time, and the reactor and the wall of completed now as well, so that's really, really good. Unfortunately for me, the Reaper scouts the wrong way, so I will see this at the last uh, scouting path, you know. Ooh, Queen already down there. Ready to spit soon. Another queen. And I like his opening. It's a bit safe. Because uh, speed is so much earlier. I mean, speed will take now 20 seconds. Yeah, speed is earlier. Where's the Reaper? So, there we go. And there's the factory. There we go. And there's the Overlord. So, he's lucky. sees it. But he might lose this Overlord. Oh, that's not good. No, he's so bad. The space cow. In danger. Oh, no will explode into a thousand pieces and there we go. Okay, okay. And there's the Reaper, ooh, carefully. Doesn't get any kills here, but now I know wait a second speed is way too early. But at least I supply blocked him and ooh, early Roach Warren, look at that. This is really early. Normally I think you get it on, uh, on minute four? If you want to be safe or go into Roach Ravager. I'm with a third base, but here, speedlings. Mm, oh, nice. Or already evac'd. Uh, all of that. A natural. <clears throat> and those circlings are quite dead. Yes. Uh, some escape. So, not the best micro here for me. That was a mistake. I could have killed all of those. Mm, but more roaches and more circlings. And in Convice, you can see. Equal in worker. I'm a little bit ahead, so he's going full all in here for for the time being. And this can work out. He doesn't have any bane links, but roaches are quite good against marines, even with medivac. So roaches have some nice burst damage, I would say, the, which is difficult to heal against. So if I'm not mistaken, three shots kill a marine. Uh, where are all your roaches? He morphed all of them into Ravager, oh my goodness. Yeah, but if it was 14, 28, 40, no, you need four shots, okay. Oh no, it's 16, haha, <laughs> yeah, then it's three shots. You can three shot a marine. Uh, and there we go, wall of not completed. Ah, uh, I don't know about this one. The serpents are streaming in, but 
somehow they don't find the surface area they are looking for and now it's just Ravagers and Stim is about to complete in 5 seconds here oh no that's not looking good uh, oh no I don't know about this all his surfings died and there's Stim and all the Ravagers get focused down I think this push is over wow and you can see that was not a good trade <laughs> Oh, he's so mad. And that's it. GG. So, yeah. <laughs> this is... If, if you're a Zerg player, don't try this at home, kids. Just just don't. Um, if you do, you need way better... Way better execution. Mm, but I think this push is really weak. I mean, really, really weak. You know? And yeah, maybe he should have streamed in and I don't know, he got no surface area with the circlings. Normally what you wanna do is get around get us around on all this army. And then throw down the corrosive bile and eat them up. And then you win. But if you don't get it, ah that's bad. Okay, this was a very short one. Uh, at some point I wanted to show you <laughs> how to defend easily without any scouting look at that I didn't even scout I just went in with the Reaper saw early speed and that's it and I, ju I just continued with my build 60 marine medivac that's it and you can defend it quite easily it's possible if you need pull some SUVs it's fine uh, but yeah this 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 push is really not too strong and if he plays this a lot against Terran I don't know how he went master tier 1 Seriously, um, but maybe other turns have lots of trouble against it, or maybe I just went lucky here. I can't tell you. But anyways, thank you so much for watching, even though it was a short one. I hope you enjoyed. As always, I wish you a very nice day and goodbye. Hey, oh there! Thank you for watching. If you'd like to support me, simply hit the thumbs up button. Do you have any wishes, feedback, or suggestions? Put them into the comments below. You may also subscribe if you're new to the channel. I wish you a wonderful and stress-free day, take care, bye bye.